Hello, this is Jen with glasses, and I'm streaming goblins to the buffoon prince. And I keep wanting to say the buffoon king, but obviously there is a buffoon king, but we're looking for the buffoon prince. Hey, hi, DS6. DS6 says, greetings and good luck. Thank you. I was a little bit nervous about the stream. Normally it takes about 33 seconds for me to be able to see that I'm live on Twitch, and it took like close to two minutes. So... <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> Hopefully it just means that things were a little slow and we're not going to have technical difficulties, but we'll see. So before we start in with the game, with this funky psychedelic theme, uh, I just want to talk about kind of the state of the stream and some things going on. So here's the deal. Uh, I got invited to go out to PAX East, which is in Boston like 41 days by uh, some really good friends of ours. Russ and I are both going. So I don't know if any of you guys are going. Probably not, I'm guessing, since most of you guys are on the West Coast. But we will be there. And because we're going to be there, um, I made up some cool little swag things from my channel. So I made up some little buttons and stuff to give out to people to have my some of my little stuff and some little drawings I did of... Uh, well, who did I do? I did uh, one of Graham doing a face plant, and I did one of uh, uh, Roger Wilco in his space suit and some other cool little stuff that I did. So just to let you guys know, um, if you happen to be there, let me know. And it's in thousands and thousands of people, but I'll be on Twitter, and maybe I can give out some stuff to you. If not, that's cool too. Also, what that means is I hope to keep some of these pins and stuff for giveaways in the channel later. If I can figure that out. I'm figuring stuff out as I go. Like I've been on, I've been streaming for less than a year and I only stream twice a week. So, uh, but my time investment for the background stuff is pretty high, mostly because I'm learning. So I'm figuring out now like, oh, this is how you get that cool little channel robot. Oh, this is how you do this. So I hope the more I figure out, the better I get at this and the better I get at like the tech side too. Cause all that stuff I'm learning, like all the editing stuff, I'm learning on the fly, like editing the podcast that uh, Russ and I do. Like I totally, <laughs> I totally learned that myself the hard way, figuring it out. Which is why the farther our podcast goes on, the better and better the sound gets. As I figure out, oh, that's a bad idea. Oh, that's a good idea. So I just want to let you guys know. And um, so if you happen to be there, tweet at me, and I'll say hi, and I'll give you like a cool little button that has like my. A little channel icon logo on it or maybe you can pick there's like four or five so you can pick which one you want if I have them I don't I don't know I don't think they're gonna be all given out guys it's mostly just me uh, Russ insisting that I do some sort of not advertisement but that I talk to people about what I do which I don't I'm not necessarily opposed to I just hate like oh uh, I don't want to be a salesman for anything not even myself so, but I ha I'm like, I'm good. If people are interested, I'll give them a button. <laughs> if they ask me what my buttons are about, then I'll give them a button. Um, so we will both be there. Russ and I will both be there. So that's, I mean, that's it. And then also, um, I'm getting really serious about, about adding uh, another night to the stream. And I'm really excited about it. Oh, uh, hi. Hi, DJ. DJ said, how do you get your voice at a cute tone or is it natural? Uh, it's natural when I talk on the stream, but I definitely tweak it when it's on the podcast because, uh, and I, <laughs> because I kind of have to, because sometimes it gets piercing. <laughs> well, Russ makes me laugh too loud and then it like cracks the mic. So I have to laugh less loud when I'm doing the podcast, um, which is funny. I'm okay when I'm here cause I'm sitting like literally two or three inches from the mic. Okay, well, hi, and also, hi, DJ. I haven't seen you in a while. Good to see you. All right, guys, so that was my big announcement. I'm going to PAX East, and I have buttons. And once I get back from PAX East, I'll try and figure out a way I can give those out on the channel. Uh, so that's it. That's all I had to say. And thank you guys for coming tonight. All right, let's figure this out, which is why you guys really came. All right. Oof. I can get this to work. All right, so in our inventory, we have a stone, a bottle, Matches. We got the drumstick last time. And the kind elixir. We still have the kind elixir. Ooh, that's interesting. So, we're trying to get... I can get this guy to play. And then the mus musical note floats up here. 
and then we're supposed to grab it, I think, for the turkey. I mean, this guy, without this, this game is pretty trippy anyway, because we need to give the musical note to a turkey man who um, basically, yeah, he needs the music. I don't get it. DJ, oh, but your voice is still cute. Thank you. Actually, I watch you a lot, but I don't always chat. And that's fine. I like it when people chat, but you don't have to. <laughs> TJ says, oh, just kidding. That was an attempt at a cheesy pickup line. <laughs> um, so, no, you don't. If you guys just watch, that's fine, too. It's nice if you chat. All right, so let's figure this out, what we're doing. All right. <sighs> so the only thing, I haven't used a couple of things. I haven't used the, I didn't use the kind elixir, because that's not what we drank. Um, last time it was this weird mushroom stuff. Yeah. I mean, they just went full out on the, like, we're basically giving us drugs. So we, we haven't used the kind elixir either, which I wonder if that would help or not. I don't think that would help with the note, but we can see DJ also use your stream later usually. So I can't always watch you. Oh, well, sorry. At least it's, I do, I do try and do a good job of keeping my highlights up so you don't miss anything. It all just depends on schedule. Like things get so crazy. It's, it's just easier to do it this time of day or night. All right. What are we doing here? So let me get Winkle, who I still insist should be called Finkus. Let's get him. Who's the one? Okay, there's the door. Let me just check this out. Oops. So he goes in the door. There we go. And he ends up up here. Wait, didn't we? Ha okay, no, he lands down here. So he goes over here. Yeah, I know this is the right path here. He's gonna talk to this dude. Uh, no, you were supposed to talk to the dude. Talk to the dude. And this guy needs. DJ, what time is it where you live? It's like 9:50. I live on the East Coast, which is why I'm going to Pax East, as opposed to Pax West or the other Paxes. All right, let's, can you talk to him? I just want to hear what he says. Okay, so that goes up there, and it breaks. I'm just trying to figure out, so there's a hole. Okay, that puts him up there, but what's this hood thing? DJ, I see. Yeah, so it's not quite so late if, well, I don't know where you're at, but um, usually a lot of people watching when they're in the Midwest or California because they're behind me a little bit. <laughs> Unless they're in Germany and then they're way ahead of me, and then it's really early in the morning. All right, Winkle, we got that. We got this last time. What is this hood thing for, though? All right, so let's try this again. Oh no, 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 no! They hop off at the slightest provocation. No, dudes, no. Here we go. Okay. No, no, no! I need. Uh. I just want him to be close enough to to be close enough to the note. I. Where's he going? TJ says, these guys look like they could be on a cereal box. Uh, pretty much, yeah. Rice Krispie treats, anyone? That's what they look like. Rice Krispies, guys. DJ, I'm French, actually. Oh. <laughs> French Canadian or from France? So it's quite late here. Oh, I bet it is. I've had people, uh, French Canadians come and watch. But I didn't realize you were in a film club. Haha, -ha, party! Well, it is probably very late in France. <laughs> Thank you for coming by anyway. All right, I'm going to try. Let me give Fingus. I just want to see what happens. I'm going to try the different things we have. So I'm going to try the kind elixir. Let me switch it over to this dude. All right, let's see if we can do it. See if we can. Nope, did nothing. Bim Clunk. Hi, Bim Clunk! Bim Clunk says, ha ha, party! DJ says, 100% pure French. There you go. I won't get into that debate. <laughs> All right. I know there's tension between the different uh, Quebec and, and France. 
All right, hang on. So we tried the kind elixir. Let's try the drumstick. Let's try the drumstick and see if that does anything. All right, come on. Nope, does nothing. Hmm. Can we use the? I don't want to use the drumstick on the, gu the guitarist. That seems good. Can we use it on the saxophonist? We can't use it on the drummer, which seems right. I mean, just checking. I'm doing a little pixel hunting here. Yeah, we can't use it on the drummer. It would make the most sense. I think we're supposed to make all all three of these guys play because it don't, doesn't make sense that just the guitarist is playing. Um. Is it? Can we use the drumstick on the headlight? That's interesting. I'm gonna try that. What's weird he has his hair tied in the back with a bow, but it's like a flesh colored bow, so it just it looks strange. It looks like he's got his ears tied behind his head. Oh no, you can't. Can we use the I'm just gonna see what else we can use the drumstick on. Oh they do! What happened there? Ooh, I saw something up there. DJ said, no way, I know what they remind me of with those spiky pink hairs, those little trolls. Yes, they do! They do! They do remind me of uh, those little troll, scary troll dolls. Okay, use drumstick guns. Okay, so when... What is that? What is that? That's weird, okay. Look up right up here, look. What is that? It sort of looks like a Okay, I want okay, let me hang on, let me switch guys. Go up here. There's gotta be a way I can get up here. Ah, uh, how did we get up here last time? Let's go go in here. Okay. No one's breaking into my house. That bumping sound you're hearing is my ice maker. I put some ice in the cat's bowl so he would leave me alone. No, 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 no. Ah. Uh. Okay, let's try that. Let's see if I'll use it. Okay. So that's weird. I don't know what that thing is that comes up when I when I, it looks like a piece of gray dynamite. I don't know what that's supposed to be. Can we use the drumstick on the saxophonist? I want to see if that does anything. My cousin used to have a huge collection of those troll dolls. I don't get freaked out every time I spent the night in her house because I just felt like they would be staring at us all night and I would not sleep at all. She just had so many of them all over her dresser and they were just like all facing the bed. And their little eyes would shine in the dark. It was, no. <laughs> I was like, no way. I would just lay there, like, awake long after she went to sleep. Just, like, waiting for the sunlight to come up in the morning. I was not closing my eyes on those little dudes. <laughs> Alright, can we use it on, let's see if we can use it on the stocking cap. So the only successful thing we've used it on is the spring. Okay, let me switch out the dudes. Let me switch out. I'm gonna put this back in my inventory. DJ says spooky. Yeah, I thought so. I was not a big fan of that. He says, ha. The DJ says, haha, I know, right? Yeah, I just not a big fan of them. I know they're they're like one of those things where it's like, oh, they're so ugly, they're cute, but I never really saw that. Alright, let me. Let's see what happens when he plays the, uh, when Winkle plays the drumstick. Okay, let me go. Whoops. Nope, nope. Don't do that. Go over here. Let me, I'm trying to switch out guys, but it doesn't always, this doesn't really have a good system for switching the people out, I don't think.
What is that? So it does that when both of them. Yeah, DJ said, I didn't understand kids that found them cute. Yeah, I didn't either. I guess you could. Okay, why are you saying yippee? Oh, wait, let me switch this out. I'm gonna go to Fingus. No, you can't. All right, so what is this up here? Hi, Matt! Mac Matt McGrath is here. Hello! How are you doing? All right. Dang it. So if I use the drumstick on here... Matt McGrath, I wasn't following. <laughs> it's okay! I did that with Ab's nerdy. I was like, he hasn't gone live since I started following him. And then I realized I wasn't following him. <laughs> All right. So we know. This is what we know. We know if Winkle. Not. Uh, sorry. Not Winkle. The guy I think should be called Fingus, who's known as Winkle. All right. If he plays on the spring. So maybe I need to find some. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Cammy Hamden. I'm gonna say it totally wrong. I'm just gonna say Cam, okay? Hi, Cam. Cam says, "Come on, Matt, get on my level." <laughs> All right, so I figured out apparently half of the puzzle, <laughs> whatever that means. Okay, so we've got, I've got, I think, so that makes this activate. Is there anything else we can play? What happened? Oh no, wrong dude, wrong dude. Let me talk, I want Fingus to talk to this dude. <laughs> Cammy says I followed like 5,000 years ago. Could you give us a few variations on the theme? Oh. No, nothing. Can I give the saxophonist kindness elixir? Be kinder to a saxophonist. Oh, thank you. Kame. Thank you very much, Kame. I, yeah. I'm kind of terrible pronouncing names anyway. So thank you, Kame. Got it. Hopefully forever, and I won't ever mess it up again. But I can't make that promise. <laughs> Matt McGrath says Kame is what Miss Cleo lady said in the late '90s TV ads. <laughs> Kame, it's okay. Thank you. Okay, can we use the kind of elixir down here? It's from Dragon Ball Z! I remember them, the beginning of him saying that, Kame! But I don't remember what the rest of what he said was. Obviously, it's the rest of your name. Alright. Did that work? That didn't work. That didn't work either. So... Now the bottle's empty. <laughs> All right. Hmm. Let me throw the stone down here. I remember watching that on Cartoon Network when I that's the first my first exposure to it when it was first on there like the late 90s early 2000s and just being like having the worst day at my crappy high school job. And just like watching those and I'm like what are they ever gonna fight because there's so many episodes where they talked about fighting and they started to fight but it would be like a 13 episode arc before they actually like started battling it out <laughs> all right that didn't work let me throw a stone at the saxophonist stop being such a jerk we need you to play a song all right I'm gonna see I remember if it's been like that's the problem when you don't stream over the weekend 
Because now I'm like, how did I get up here last time? Somehow I did. Tommy says, Matt McGrath loves the old point and clicks, and DBZ is my jam. I own every episode. Yeah, I was I was just thrilled to watch it. I was like, oh, this is nice to sit here and just watch watch them try and get those Dragon Balls. And forget what a crappy day I had at my minimum wage learning how to work job. Alright. So, if I can get him. How did I get up here last time? Alright, I want to see, does this only happen when the music's playing? So that, then we're kind of in a little bit of trouble. Make sure I have the right guy. I always click on the wrong guy with this thing. Bum, bum, bum. No! Exactly, just like that. Nope. No thank you. It's my own fault. I understand the system, too. I'm just like, I know what their names are. I know what they're supposed to be doing. <gasps> Are we supposed to it looks like a it looks like a piece of dynamite. Are we supposed to light that with matches? Ooh. Alright, because this is the first time I've had to have multiple maybe it's not. Alright. Multiple. No, don't oh. Alright, come here. Stop doing that. How do we... No, I just want you... Oh. Put it back in there. Go back in there. We'll figure this out. No, don't go... Okay, unless you can go... No, don't... Oh. Hmm. How did we get over here last time? I didn't leap from here. I was able to go up and get... Okay, let me see. I think I need to switch these guys out. Alright. Let me see. Make sure I have Winkle to have everything matches and drumstick. Okay, I'm going to switch this out. I'm going to put this guy up here. I like how the I like the mechanic that they each have different skills. Um, it's just a little less clearly defined in Goblins too. In Goblins one, you knew what everybody did, but Goblins two, it's a little bit like you just have to try them out constantly, see how they handle it differently. They have their own little personalities. Okay, I'm gonna give this. Make sure Winkle again. Poor naming choices in their part matches. All right, then I'm gonna go. Yeah, okay, listen. Listen, Fingus, you're gonna get a drumstick. No, I didn't want to. Oh. Mm. All right, let's try this again. Fingus. Okay, Winkle has the matches. Okay, then I've switched over. Drumstick. Okay. So you're gonna use the drumstick on spring. I'm gonna switch to. Matches on. There we go. Light it. I'm too late. No. All right. Yep. Couldn't like light up his amp. I think I tried this before. We can't light up his amp cord. It just, just bounce. <gasps> Oh, it's just if we bounce on it. So if we bounce on it. We are both on it together. Okay, I forgot about that. Okay, hang on. Okay, hang on. Stop using the matches. Stop lighting your nose on fire. It's not a good idea. Okay. Don't worry about using... Okay, hang on. You don't worry about using the drumstick because I don't think we need it. I think we need to get back up here and light whatever that thing is that goes off when we do this. Okay. Did that tuba just go off? Is 
Stop trying to use the matches on everything. Okay. Wait, why did we do that? Oh, because it would put them out. Okay. Hmm. All right. Here we go. Come on. Because this would spray us every time we'd go over to go over. That's why we plugged it up with the with the um with that. How do I get up yep. here? Stop lighting your nose on fire. Okay. It's not a good idea. Oh, uh, so maybe if you light the dynamite, then they they explode with the power of music. Because this is sort of like a psychedelic dream, which means that it's not correlating to reality it, that much. <laughs> All right, so... Ah, how did I get up here last time? So don't do matches on... Don't... Don't do that. I jumped off this, I think, okay. How did we do this? Crap. This is what happens. The one time I'm like, I'm not gonna watch the end of my last highlight. I'm just gonna go into it. Because I was late. Okay. Did you jump on here? Jump on here. Come on, Fingus. Okay, let's see if we can do it this way. I need to get him really high. Well, not literally. They already are. <sighs> I love that his hair is blown black, his tie is, his tie is blowing in the wind as he sits on this giant mushroom. Alright. Come on, guys. Do that last time. Hmm. Did I just jump with them both together? I don't think I did that though. Crap. <laughs> DJ says, "Little gray dynamite." Yeah. It's it's them just made it boring looking so that you wouldn't get too excited about it. All right, come on, get down. Now Fingus is refusing to get off this thing. Yeah, I don't know either. Yeah, jump on the spring. Jump on the spring. Fingus! Alright, I don't know what he's doing. How is that like? So not great. He's not a great writer. Okay, come on, get up there. How did we do that last time? So I just need someone there to. S if I can get up there, close enough to here, I can probably light it. All right, come on. No. No, don't. I don't want you to climb down. I just want you to stand right there. What is that thing to use matches on? Oh, yeah. That's exactly what I wanted to do, and he didn't do it. All right, come here. No, don't use the matches on anything. Don't light the door on fire. They're always trying to do things. Where I'm like, that's not a great idea to light the door on fire, guys, even if it is a mushroom door. All right, so what I, he did what I wanted him to do, but unfortunately, later than I wanted him to do it. All right. I just want you to jump down here, dude. That's all I want you to do. See, just jump right on the spring. See the spring? Just jump on it. Like you just did a second ago. <sighs> passive. These these goblins are super passive aggressive. 
They know I want them to do this, and they're like, no way. Alright, crap. Why won't he jump on there? Because he will. Okay. So let's try it. Let's flip it. Let's flip the guys and see if it helps. <sighs> These goblins puzzles, I enjoy them, but at the same time, the timing thing drives me crazy. Because it's difficult. Which, I, it's satisfying when you get it right, but when you get it wrong 50 billion times, you just want to throw the game through the window, which is like all retro games, really. Most of them. Alright, so let's see if I can do this. Yippee. You're saying yippee, but he's not doing anything. Can you jump on the spring? Why isn't Wink... Okay, there it is. Can't get to it. Dang it. Now he does. He'll only jump after I'm off of it. What did we do last time? Did they both go up here last time and then we jumped together? Winkle? Okay, oh, you have to move, Fingus, right? Otherwise, heaven forbid, they work together. No, he won't go in. Okay, so it's only it's only one at a time up here. Okay. So, Winkle goes right here. It's not telling me what that thing is. See, he'll gladly jump on it. I wish we could just pick up this hood thing. Because I think that's helpful for us to do. And there's a headlight, too. Dang it. So how is that remotely helpful? Good, you can put your head in there and it comes out the other side. That doesn't seem too helpful. What kind of neck do you have? Do you have like a coil of spring neck in there? Cause you're not a big dude. You shouldn't be able to do that. It's like, hello! Hello! It's like the grossest party trick ever. Look at me. I can stretch my, stretch my neck out. Twice as tall as I am. Don't be freaked out. I'm okay. I need, we need to light this little stick of dynamite. Right, let me go over here. How did we do this last time? We got up here to, to take it, and I don't remember how. I thought we just bounced up here, but maybe not. All right, Fingus, Fingus, go up here. Winkle, why don't you try and go? All right, can you... Why are you yipping that? McGrath. Oh. Matt says, sorry my chrome crashed. Yeah, that happens. Twitch is funny like that. It gets really weird. I kept trying. It, sometimes it'll kick me off like four or five times in a row. And I'll, I actually got an Ethernet cable to fix the problem. And sometimes it does because my internet's a little bit faster with it, but sometimes it really doesn't. You don't know what's causing the problem. <laughs> Matt says, I missed everything after I saw... After... <laughs> Alright. After you sassed Kame. Alright, so they keep saying yippee, but they won't do what I want them to do. So, yeah, that's what I want them to do. Except bounce at the same time and get a guy up here. Yippee. So you can... <laughs> Hi, Dine Todd. Dine Todd says, Oh, the sun grows up. Mrs. Glasses is here. <laughs> Why are you up so early? Okay. Hmm... No. Keeps telling me it won't do that. So what am I doing wrong? 
Okay, let's try it like this and see what happens. Might as well give the guy the... Grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. <laughs> All right. Let's try him up here and him down here. Dang it, I think I have this half solved. But there's a piece I'm not remembering from last time. This is the same... Oh, come on, Winkle. You know I didn't want you to go down there. So you... Dine Todd, you streamed all night long. You played all night long. Oh. Didn't you, didn't your brain just die after a while? I see these guys doing really long streams, like eight. Well, they're not really long for, like, streaming. They'll do you know, 10, 12, 14 hours, and I'm just like, how's your brain not mush? This is not as easy as it looks <laughs> to talk and play a game and try and be somewhat interesting and not just sit there and not say anything because <laughs> you're frustrated. I could not imagine. All right, I'm going to give this guy the matchsticks. Oh. Don Todd says, yeah, stream and play. I think it was 10 hours. Yeah, I think I have to work my way up to that. No, 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 Winkle. Sorry, I'm yelling at the guys on the screen. I think I have to wor work my way up to that, because I don't think... I'll just switch out, guys. No, I didn't... Oh, I really do not like this inventory system. It's really hard to get the guys to pick up what you want. But I feel like I have to, like, work my way up to it, like, almost like learning how to train for a marathon. Tan Tan Yin, yeah, now my eyes burn and I have square eyes. <laughs> oh, that sounds like something that's a really bad nightmare. <laughs> it's like, did you have that nightmare where all your teeth fall out? And, uh, yeah, and you have square eyes. That one. You know the one. Okay, I'm gonna make him jump. He's too slow. Just leap over there. All right. Ah. Wait. How did we get over here last time? I really can't believe I don't remember. Okay. Okay. So anytime they jump on, it starts to get more, but it doesn't stay up very long. It looks like a weird little stick of dynamite just coming out of his drumstick there. So, this was spraying water before, so maybe that it's supposed to try and put that out. But we don't want to put it out. We want to get the band going. Oh, I'm so close. I don't want to be here all night. I want to solve this and be done. How did I get up there last time? Oh, gosh, guys. So I heard like a tuba sound, but nobody got bounced up. That's it. So that's not helpful either. Well, I hope you can sleep during the day, Don Todd, because I, whenever I worked third shift, I hated it so much. And the thing I hated the worst was trying to sleep once the sun was up. I was like, ah. Uh. You drink so much coffee staying awake the last couple of hours, and then you're just like, no one say good morning to me. Everyone say good night. It's nighttime for me. All right, does he still have the matches? I think he does. All right, let's go. How do we get the spring to keep going? He's too slow. Dintod, it is night at this time in Germany. Good. So the sun's not up yet. What does he do with this? 
Oh, that's how we did it! Oh my gosh, thank goodness. I totally forgot about that part, because I'm a dingbat, and because it's ridiculous. Ugh. Dine Todd, it's 3.20 or 3.23 a.m. in Germany. Oh, okay, I think you've come later in the stream, and, uh, oh, this is perfect. Okay. And I, and it's been like 4 or 5 in the morning, so that's why I'm probably confused about the time difference. Okay. All right, all right, hang on. I figured this out. Yeah! Finally. Uh, no, stop. I don't... Here you go. Finger... I don't like this inventory system. I want Winkle to have the matches. Okay. Winkle gets the matches. Okay. Just... I'm switching over to Fingus. Okay. Fingus is gonna go. Winkle's is gonna use the matches in the headlight, right? He's gonna... Well, he's gonna... Oh gosh, how is this supposed to work? Okay, ugh. Stop it. Stop lighting your nose on fire. This is the part I'm supposed to be excited. But um, I'm still frustrated about <laughs> making these guys do what I know I'm, they're supposed to do. Just stick your... Okay. Alright, maybe we're not supposed to light it, we're supposed to grab it. Alright. Try again. Do this. Oh, it gives me enough time. Okay, I have enough time. I have enough time if I do this right. Okay. So if I do this right... Winkle! Oh, he walked too close, guys. It won't let me do the headlight thing. Okay. Yes! Okay, okay, we got it! We got it! We got it! We got it! It's a pump? <laughs> I thought it was a stick of dynamite. Wait, what is it? It is a pump, guys. It is like a bicycle pump. Huh? <laughs> Dia six says nice grab. Russell Passel says yay. Dine Todd said yeah. It is a it's a bicycle pump. So that's not super helpful. That's why I'm not even gonna ask why. Um, I'm not even gonna ask because okay, so we have a guitarist. Can we use the bicycle pump on the saxophonist? <laughs> Dynaton says, ha ha, it looks like dynamite. <laughs> DJ says, lol, uh, a pump. <laughs> All right, well, uh, let's give let's give it to Winkle since he, he, since he got it. What can we use it on? I want to try it on the saxophonist because... Look, look here, sir. Oh. Uh, weird. Okay, well, we did. We got part of the puzzle. <laughs> Dein Todd, swearing in German. My grandma used to always swear in German because uh, she didn't think we knew what it meant, and then we did. <laughs> We're like, busted, grandma. Oh, I'm supposed to get him up here. I took him the wrong way. We know what you're saying. I had a roommate in college named Emily Hong, and she was from Korea. And she says, "Why is people? Why do people always want to know all the swears in Korean?" She's like, "They always ask me to teach them Korean." And she's like, "They only want to know the swears." All right, so let's. I don't know what this is going to do, but we'll see. So you pump him up, and there's a B. Oh, it's a mosquito. It's a mosquito? DJ, now you can pump it up. Haha, <laughs> I get it. Pump like you know since they are musicians. Yes. It's definitely a 90s reference to you. Pump, pump, pump it up. Alright, so... There's a mosquito. Are we gonna hit it with... Okay. <laughs> DJ, please laugh. <laughs> it takes me a minute, because... It's a delay! Russell Passel, yeah, Jen, pump up the jam. Pump up the jam, pump it up. Dun 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 dun. That played in the roller skating rinks for years and years. Alright. What well, can I use a mosquito? Maybe the drums? I don't want to light. 
We could either light the mosquito on fire, which seems like a bad move. We could hit it with a drumstick. I can't... I wonder... Because that's where the note goes, too. So we're going to... The first thing I'm going to try, I'm going to try different stuff on the mosquito directly. Mosquito directly. And then if that doesn't work, I'm going to have the musician play and then see if that interacts with the mosquito at all. Dine Todd, the mosquito fly away, and so do the same. Wish a nice dream, lovely Mrs. Glasses, greets America, and Mr. Glasses from Germany. <laughs> Thank you, Dine Todd. I hope that wasn't a hint, and I hope there was a guess at the end there, sir. But hey, get some good sleep. Uh, see you next time, hopefully. All right, so... All right, I will do that, because I I'm, I'm think it's a suggestion. I don't think he was giving me a hint. All right, here's the pump on the saxophonist. Uh, no, it did nothing. <laughs> well, that didn't go well. No, I don't want to use the bottle anymore. I want to, again, not my favorite inventory system. I'm just excited I did something on this puzzle. <laughs> Time Todd, yes, yes, you will see me, I promise. All right. Okay. Let's try this again. What do we do with the Oh, I can't... You know what? You can't get your inventory items out at certain points, and this is the point I can't get it out. I wish it, if the mosquito was bigger, I would think we'd have to jump on him for a ride. But uh, I don't think that's the case. So we tried the bottle. I want to try the drumstick and just see... If not, we're going to have the guitarist play and see if it interacts with it somehow. Alright. No, 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 no! Oh, come on! I swear, the programmers, when they did this, said, you know, we know they're going to be doing a complicated puzzle, and we're just going to make it more difficult for them to manipulate uh, inventory items while they're doing this. All right, I'm going to take the jump strike. Now, see, the hard thing is, like, how do I... I have to switch it over. Use the pump on the saxophonist. On the mosquito. Nope, nothing. I'm really surprised the mosquito doesn't just murder us. Like, it doesn't just suck us dry and be, leave us like a little desiccated corpse. Alright, that didn't work. Alright, let's try... The kind elixir might work. That's interesting. Use the pump on the saxophonist. It's a kind elixir. Make them, let's make the mosquito kind. Nope. Let's try the stone. Papa was a rolling stone. Alright. I mean, that's the most likely thing I would use in a mosquito is a stone. Out of all those things, I would just try and crush it so before it bit me. Okay, stone, bottle, drumstick. We didn't try the drumstick yet, although I'm not really excited about it to use on the mosquito, but you don't know. Alright, I think that's everything. Stone, bottle, matches. Okay, I'm going to try and talk to the uh, guitarist and see if it makes a difference. I'm excited, guys. I'm getting someplace. So this is why I always, always, always last watch the last 10 minutes of my previous streams so I remember this stuff. DJ, a pet mosquito! Alright, so let's go over here. I'm going to talk to the guitarist. And then... Oh, it's too early. Crap. Come on, hurry up. No, it did nothing. That was for nothing. So we used the pump on the... And then it does... Okay. Yeah, that does nothing. Because then, um... That's... Well... <sighs> Am I supposed to jump up there with the... Uh, can I use the pump on the stocking cap? Am I supposed to jump up there and... Like, blow up the mosquito while this is all happening? I don't... These guys don't move that fast. That's the problem. 
So they, it's weird that those two things can exist in the same space and they don't interact at all. Alright, let's try this again. Oh, wrong timing. Oh, this is why I could never ever in a billion years be a speedrunner. I mean, I'm not talented at it at all. But, um... <laughs> you'd think. It didn't do anything. So... Hmm. I'm gonna switch these guys out and see what else they do differently. So I'm gonna have... Fingus, okay, I'm gonna get have Winkle get rid of the pump. I'm gonna have Fingus take the pump. Because they do things. Let's see what happens when he uses it. And also, I'm gonna move you out of here, dude. Oh! Oh, okay, hang on. So I was using the wrong guy. I got gotcha, you. Wrong thing. Ah, oh, those notes need to interact. Okay, so first, go talk to this guy. Ah, oh, talk to this guy. There we go. Ah, oh, timing's wrong. I think you're thinking that DJ's like, shank one of those blokes and use his blood-soaked underwears to attract the mosquito. Let me get this down. <laughs> DJ says that's the only solution I'm seeing. I think you have the wrong game. This is grand, not Grand Theft Auto. Okay, almost. Okay, I think they have to, like, match up, and I just have to get the timing right. DJ, oh, never mind. Yeah, they're ridiculous. These are ridiculous. Almost. <sighs> DJ, I guess this game's not metal enough. No. I mean, are there many metal bands that have a tuba player? <laughs> All right, try try this again. So does it last? Okay, the how does that Russell Basil, Grand Fet Theft Goblins, The Underpants Saga. Okay, yeah. <laughs> now, the real issue is why I want this guy playing unless, unless we use a bicycle pump on him. Is he really dead? Is this a weekend at Bernie's situation? Has their tuba player died and no one wants to say anything? So, okay, they keep shattering up there. They keep shattering. How can we do to stop them from shattering? Is it, are they playing the wrong notes? When this guy pumps up the saxophonist, you just have a mosquito up there, so that's not helpful. We need to be able to... Uh, I think this is going to be a complicated one, guys. Because here's the thing. Once, once, um... Once Winkle talks to him, he can probably do something else. I'm wondering if I'm supposed to stick his hand through the headlight and hit the drum... For this guy, who knows what this guy is? He looks like he's paralyzed. Uh, so that these notes all mix together. I think that's what I have to do, and I'm not really excited about doing it because I feel like it's going to be a pain. Alright. Okay, first thing I have to... No, 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 just... Hang on, I want to switch dudes. I don't want- Ah, oh, I didn't want him to do that. I don't still don't understand what the stocking cap is over here. Can I, I want to just pick it up. 
because I feel like that's what I could use to catch the notes in. But I don't know how to do that. All right. So I just want to switch dudes without switching. The hard thing is to switch the dudes without switching the inventory item. Because when I go up to the... There's like a little portrait thing up here that you should be able to switch back and forth between these two guys. But when I do that and I'm holding an inventory item, it literally... Um, switches out the inventory item and I get so frustrated. All right, so this guy's Winkle's going to talk to him. Then Winkle's going to You can use this th you can do that. And then you're going to get down here. Winkle. Still not helpful. Tia 6 only trained choir members can hold that note. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So that still isn't. Let me. So we're missing something. We're missing something. Because then we have to catch this thing, right? So let me see if. Let me see what I can do. If I use the pump. I go over and jump in the no I can't move so he can't really move until the, the saxophonist is done so fingers can't move Winkle I don't think Winkle can really move either so what are we missing we're missing on getting so we've got so we've got a way to make the the saxophonist play and the guitarist play but we can't get the the drummer to play. So I think we're gonna have to get the drummer playing. Like I don't know how, but I think we're gonna have to get him playing. Because he's the missing piece. Like I think if all three of those notes are there. Also, I think we need to get the stocking cap. I don't know how exactly, but it's a hood, not a stocking cap. I thought I'd call it a stocking cap before, maybe not. Well how do you let me see if I can use something on it. Use the stock drumstick on the stocking cap. See, yeah, it does call it a stocking cap. Sometimes it calls it a hood, and sometimes it calls it a stocking cap. It's very weird that way. I just, I think I need to actually, like, grab it. It's the only thing that makes any sense to light it on fire, I guess. Whee! No, it's not helpful. We used the stone on it before, right? Okay, so we use the stone drumstick. I think I've used that. So Okay, that's not helpful. Well, you know what? Kind of looks in the stocking cap. Nope. So, because I mean, what is this? Yeah, it calls it a hood and then it calls it a stocking cap. I don't know. I guess it doesn't really matter as much. This guy can, he can put his So Fingus can put his head through there. DJ, oh, hey, by the way, did you play the Tales of Monkey Island? I played the Mystery of Monkey Island. I've, the only Monkey Island I've played is the last one I played, which is the Secret of Monkey Island, not the Mystery. Uh, I haven't played any of them other than that. So I have the second one on my GOG account. I just haven't. Uh, I'm, it's in line to play at some point, but I haven't played that one yet either. It's on the list. DJ, I got it on Steam and it's super cheap and pretty good. Yeah, I'll have to check it out. Right now, I do have some. I have some. I the GOG had a bunch of sales and a bunch of different games, and so I have like several games like sitting there waiting to be played. But I definitely want to finish the Monkey Island uh, series, and that sounds like fun. It's nice when you can get things for like a dollar fifty or cheap. DJ, it's the Telltale Games one. Oh, it's the one they did after. Yeah, they're doing some pretty big stuff. I mean, Monkey Island, but I mean, they just did that, the um, Walking Dead game, didn't they? Alright. So how do we get... I'm gonna try... So Winkle... Like, he needs to wake this dude up. But there's nothing there to grab. So that's the weird thing. Let's see if there's, cause 
Let's make sure there's nothing else coming out here because we we thought we had everything, and uh, we didn't. Okay, so we got that. So what happens? Can we take the? Uh, can we take our clip oh. back? I guess not. All right. So the only thing we haven't used, we've used the hole for stuff. We got this guy going. We haven't used the hood for anything. So. Is there a whole thing we need to do with the mosquito first? And then go back? Alright, so Winkle's the one. Alright, we're gonna send- I'm gonna send Fingus up here. We'll see if we can catch the mosquito and then Winkle, Winkle will be over here. Alright. What can we do? Can we just grab the mosquito, I wonder? I just want to try and see, because I feel like we have to do something with the mosquito first. Yippee. Okay, so. And then, can we just grab him? No, 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 no. No, you can't just grab him. Okay. There's a reason a mosquito's coming out. It's not for, it's not for no reason. Try again, Winkle. I mean, it is a funny gag there's a mosquito coming out, but that's not why. No, that's not helpful. And there's nothing else like lighting up or anything, right? There's the guitarist. There's the headlight. There's the tube. There's the weird... Mushroom guy, is that a sculpture? Is he alive? I don't know. There's the spring. Hmm. Well, I'm glad you enjoyed it, DJ. The, the Tales of Monkey Island. I'm interested to see it. Okay. There's a mushroom in the front. I don't want you really interact with this guy at all. Right, let me try Winkle and see. What can we use the pump on? Can we use the pump on the hose? Because that would be cool. No. Can we use the pump on the headlight? No. You just have to try. I don't think I've tried. They both do different things with their stuff sometimes, so. No, he's not going to do anything. Alright, let me just make sure I've tried everything with Winkle. Oh, guys! Oh my gosh! I'm so angry right now. I'm so angry! Why couldn't Fingus do it? Why did it have to be Winkle? Yeah, use net on what? Probably on this... Yeah. Ugh. Oh my gosh. I can't. Oh. You disgust me, game. I'm so angry at you right now. <sighs> I'm going to see if we catch the mosquito first, because I think that's probably our, our first point. That mosquito didn't come out for... There's a reason. There's a reason. I cannot believe that. I'm so angry at this game right now. All right, let me give Fingus the stupid... The stupid net. Then I'm gonna give Winkle the pump. Alright guys? Oh my gosh, ridiculous. Ridiculous 90s game. Yes, use the nun- yeah. <laughs> okay, so we did need that mosquito. Okay, cool. DS6. The game manipulates you to avoid Winkle and creates these moments of serves you right. Yeah, exactly. The game's like, mm, you should- Okay, so now we have a mosquito. I don't know what for. Alright, so... Let's see. I want to see first if we can, um... How are we going to do this? Let me see if we can... Okay. First of all, get rid of the pump, dude. I want to see if we can catch these notes one at a time. Because we might just have to catch them one at a time. Alright, so Fingus... 
you're gonna use the pump okay on the saxophone oh wait me before he does that make sure that winkle has the net no winkle has the pump i want you to have the net there you go winkle okay fingus now you get the pump okay i just don't want to get stuck in this situation where Beautiful! And it doesn't shatter either. <laughs> Russell Passel says, So I take it you're not streaming Goblins 3 next. No. No, I am not. I always need a break from Goblins because I get so angry about it. Alright, so we're going to let that note sit in there. We're going to switch these guys out again. Here you go. Oh, no. Winkle, where are you going? Fingus, get in there. Fingers, just like go with the pump situation. Get in there. <laughs> DS6. Bob might have to perform an intervention if Goblins 3 is too soon. <laughs> I don't know if you guys saw my tweet earlier. This morning, he was the biggest butt in the world because it's spring and he wants to go outside and kill things. And he literally leaped with all four paws into my coffee cup. Then he got mad because all his feet were wet and my coffee was like all over the floor. It smelled like wet cat and coffee. It was awful. He was irritated at me. And he was a giant jerk all day. He kept fleeing himself at the windows. It was crazy. Russell, as it stands, the whole house smells like coffee. And that it smelled sort of smelled like old cat coffee, which is not a good kind. That's not a good brand. If you ever see old cat coffee, don't buy it. It doesn't smell great. All right, let me get this. Now back to our regular scheduled program. By the way, if you haven't followed me on Twitter yet, you should because you get mandatory Bob pictures and he likes the camera, so some of them are pretty cute. All right. Use the pump on. Oh, we already did this. Oh, no. No, I didn't need to do it this way. What am I thinking? I'm doing the wrong thing. Oh, I forgot. I already got, we already got the note from him. I was on to the next thing. Don't worry about the pump. Alright. Does this mean we can get two types of notes out of this guy? Because he plays one kind of song the first time and a different kind of song the second time. So I think we're going to have to switch it out again. You have the net. You're fine. Right? You have the net. Don't worry about it. Okay, we got that note. Now we need to switch it out because they do different notes. DS6 says, I just like all coffee. I support Bob's subterfuge. <laughs> yeah, well, he, he, I think he was just, he just likes to, he's very vindictive when he's angry and he doesn't understand why he can't go outside mostly because we, we live around a, a pretty busy road and I'm like this is not a good idea and he just assumes it's because we're jerks like that's why he can't go outside so he gets mad at us when the weather's nice and he sees all these squirrels and chipmunks and birds that he'd love to kill and eat running around and we won't let him go outside I'm going to switch these out quick. Oh, come on, dude. <sighs> they do this on purpose. They really do. It's always tough when spring comes around because Bob is like extra bitey. I'm not a big fan of extra bitey Bob. He is hilarious, though. He runs outside when he gets the chance, but then he's so scared because he's kind of, like, agoraphobic at this point because he hasn't been out. Oh, come on! Winkle, can you cut me a break? DS6, you need to have someone build a dog. Don't use the, don't use the net. Just, oh, come on. He's killing me. Stop using the net. I just need you to get up here. Sorry, DS6 says, Winkle! Oh my gosh. These guys are trying to make me have a nervous breakdown. Winkle, uh, Winkle, DS6. <laughs> it was not Winkle. You need to have someone build a dog park in your lawn. 
I don't think he'd care. I think he'd want to go out there. But when he actually does run outside and he gets underneath the car, he, like, freezes underneath her because he realizes that it's terrifying outside. And if I shut the door, he immediately runs to the door and, like, jumps on it and, meow, like, comes right back in. So it's kind of a moot point anyway. I think Bob's mostly just disappointed in himself, guys. All right. Just be ready, dude. Don't use the nut on anything. Just I wanna just okay, Fingus, talk to this guy. <laughs> Alright, so we have all the different kinds of notes. So what can we do now? <laughs> What do we have? We have tune. Oh. Now we have a tune. I'm going to save it right here. I don't want to. Let's see. Tune. Oops. So we have the tune, which means we should be able to go back to the dude, right? Because we have the. Maybe we need to give the tune to somebody else. All right. Fingus. Give the tune to the guitarist. Oh, wrong dude. Sorry, 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 sorry. Wrong dude. I meant Winkle. No, stop. Stop what you're doing. Okay, go in there. Okay, Fingus. You give him the tune. Oh, wait. Let me make sure Winkle has the net. Okay, good. Winkle has the net. Oh my gosh, they're making- this is a very long puzzle. Give the tune to the guitarist. What? Didn't work! Use the tune on the saxophonist. D6, take the tune to the headlights and become a, a, a cartoonist? Uh. Well, I can't use it in any of the dudes. So are we just supposed to get out of here now? We don't know how we got in here. So we don't know how to get out of here. Okay, let's switch it out and see if it's just a matter of who's who's doing it. So you have a mosquito, a pump, matches, bottle. DS6. Oh, I forgot to say earlier. Happy Pi Day. Happy Pi Day, everybody! And today's like a special like rounded pie day, isn't it? If you round pie, uh, you get Anyway, so it's a happy pie day. All right, I have to figure out what we're doing here. Do we use the bottle on the tune? I don't know what we're supposed to do. Yeah. Kind of frustrated. Okay, so let's switch it out. Let's switch it out. Oh, no, just come on. You're killing me here. All right, come down here. Fingus, you go up here. Winkle, you go in here. Dia six, yes, that's true. It's like an extra special one, and it's Albert Einstein's birthday too. He's a hundred and something, hundred and twenty something, I think. Happy birthday to him! <laughs> Russell Passel says three three point fourteen to you too, Dias. All right, okay, guys. So Winkle. He's saying yippee, but yippee. yeah, nope, that's not the yippee part. Fingus, can you please get a net so we can catch the finished music? Because now it's just a. Oh, no, don't you dare! Oh! Mmm. Mmm. I hate how inventory items work in here. It's official. I really hate it. I wouldn't be so mad about it if they would let you use... Like, if you, they would let you get inventory items in action, but they don't. Alright, so tune to the guitarist. No? 
Two non-guitarists. Nope. Why does he keep saying yippee when obviously... Kind of licks her on the guitarist. Kind of licks her on ourselves. Is that what we're supposed to do to get home? <laughs> it's like Alice in Wonderland. There's no... Oh, can we... Hang on. Can we leave at any time? I don't think so. I just... I want to get out of here. Okay, here. No, we can't go anywhere. Okay, so... We have a tune. Is it not a completed song? Use tune on saxophonist. Yippee. Why does he keep saying yippee when obviously there's no yippee? Use tune on... Hole? Yippee. No. Stop saying... Oh, use tune on headlight, maybe. Maybe, um... Winkle can... Yeah, I also think this is dumb. But you know what? DJ, that inventory system is tedious. Yeah, it is. It drives me crazy. Because I shouldn't have to... It shouldn't have to be this way. <laughs> there should be an easy way. Like, I should be able to, like... Oh, uh, maybe I just found out. <laughs> maybe I should just left-click it. But I don't think so. I don't think that works for, like, switching it back and forth. All right. So we have a tune. We have a guitarist. Do we not have enough? We don't have any drums on this though. We have a we have a drum we have a drumstick. We have a we have No, we have a we don't have a drumstick anymore. We have a net. Which Fingus has. So we have a net. We don't have a drumstick anymore. We have a mosquito, though. What are we supposed to use the mosquito on? They give us multiple mosquitoes. Let's use it on the hole, maybe? Alright, I think we have the wrong guy with the mosquito. Let's try Winkle. They let us catch more than one mosquito, so that makes me feel like we're rude. Oh! Dang it, we missed our opportunity. Yep. yep, that's how we catch the last one. But guess what? Oh, I can just load it up. Load. Tune. I confirm. I mean, I can get another mos mosquito, but I'd rather just have it already. Alright, so we need to switch these guys out. Winkle needs to go down here. Fingus needs to go up here. That is the best thing they did about goblins, too. Goblins, one, you couldn't move. You could only move one goblin at a time. So you'd wait for one goblin to get all the way over to where he was going before you could move the second goblin. Okay, let me give... Let me see if I can left-click this. Okay, let me give him the net. Let me give him the mosquito. Okay. Use mosquito. No, 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 no! See? I thought I found a shortcut. It's not a shortcut. Just stop. Just stop. Just stop. I thought I found a shortcut, but I did not. Fingers, just get... Boy. No, I used to think King Graham was dumb. Dull. Difficult to deal with. No. King Graham is amazing compared to these dudes. <laughs> Alright, so mosquito on headlight, right? Okay. This guy's gonna use a net to catch the note. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Bum 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 Boom. Yes. Yes! Okay. Melody! We now have a melody, guys! Boop! Oh, it just automatically took us. Why would it do that? It just spit us out. We just got sp I'm unclear on what just happened. Okay. I'm very unclear on what just happened here, guys. Uh, why are we here? 
We can only go here in the trench. So basically, we, we solved that puzzle. Ta-da! And we have a net now. Oh, no, we don't. How come we don't have our net, guys? Mm. Let me look at my note. I did make some notes up here. Sands of time, throw it in the trench. Okay, gotcha. Hi, AFK, thanks for the host. DJ says, good game, thank you. Lilia AFK says, sup? Hey, I just solved the major part of this puzzle. And now I'm all forlorn because I have to figure out a way to solve this junk. All right, so let's try... Can't even use it. Let's try to use our different stuff. I was hoping we had a net, but they took it away. It's the melody on the player. That's a terrible little melody. <laughs> well, yes, says nice. GG. Well, I've never seen this before. This is goblins too. It is. A wonderful awful game the puzzles are very frustrating but it's fun to figure them out and I do have to say they do a very good job of most of the time the answer is just to try stuff until you figure out what they want you to do and in a good way not just like use all your inventory but they're good at guiding you to do complicated skips all right we gotta get the stupid ball away from the stupid kid so we can talk to the time guy I'm very unclear on what's happening here right now Lily, I need, I need a chill stream while I farm Stardew. This is cute. Yeah, I saw your last four or five streams on your uh, on your channel where Stardew Valley. <laughs> All right, let's get up. Let me see if I can figure out what I'm supposed to do here. Finger stands over, finger stands over here. Winkle goes in here. I should have this mapped out by now because I've done this so many stupid times, but I don't. I don't have it mapped out yet. Okay. Okay. Lily, I got kind of addicted. It looks relaxing and, addip and addicting. Alright, so let's try the kind elixir, because that's something new we don't have yet. So we're going to try that. Yeah, just hang on there, buddy. Oh, use kind elixir on house. Can you do that? Okay, we can use stuff on the house. I guess we could always do that. Never mind, I'm really excited. Well, something's not exciting. Alright. No, I don't want to... Okay, here. You go in there, Winkle. And then... Fingus, be ready. No. What do we have that's... Well, it won't let us grab it. Like, it won't let us grab the... I could have used the net, guys. What did it take that away from us? So we have the... We have the melody and the kind elixir. That's the only two things we have that are new. Okay, so let's... Let's see what's going on here. It's the only two things we have are new. <sighs> that kid is such a jerk, too. Let's try. Kind of looks around player. Let's try that. Nope. Can we use the melody on the basket? Just to see. I don't think we can, but... Nope. The saw of the table. Hi, the saw of the table. Hi, saw. I used to really like this. I used to really like this game until I replayed it and discovered how tedious some of the sections were. <laughs> I know figuring it out is a big bummer. Oh, I wonder. Okay, I think we might be able to. All right, let me see. I gotta figure some of this out here real quick. Kind of always ends up at this house. If you go in, he goes in here. He comes out there. All right, so and he goes back in. If he goes in here, where does he come out at? Right there, which seems very convenient for something, but I don't know what. If he goes in here, oh, could he use something on him? Can he drop the kindness, drop the kindness bomb on him, buddy? Let's see if we can do it this way. Okay, can you? He's going to go into the house. Oh, uh, won't let us go in. Only let us use the kindness elixir. 
Hmm. If I have it in my hand, I can't go in. But if I... I thought maybe I could drop it. Because like, look, I'm right up here if I could drop it on him. But... I can't. So... Since I can go to the trench, I might go to the trench. Oh, on the clockmakers. <gasps> can we use the, um, I wonder if we can use the, uh, melody on the clockmakers. That might be helpful. Alright, switch it out. Switch it out, man. Well, you think it would wake up the clockmaker. That's all I have to say about it. I'll let go of the melody. Alright, I'm gonna go over to the trench and just see. I don't see anything new with this dude, and I'm just I'm just frustrated about. Alright, get it out get get out of there. Alright, let's go over to the trench and see what's going on there. Can we give some of the kindness elixir to the the dude up here that we don't like? Let's see. They have a hint system, but but here's the deal. I've never seen an active joker. You haven't any got any joker here. Like the, the, This is supposed to be something where you can get a hint, but I have never seen one. So, all right, try and give him, oh, not the bottle, the kindness elixir, maybe? No, it won't let us, it's like we can't walk in. Hmm. No. So what about the melody? Use the melody on Soka. Use the melody on carpet. Don't use the melody yet. Get on the carpet. Okay, so we can't do anything until we get the sands of time. Is there anything in the tower still? Those bombs still there? Oh, they still are. How helpful. Well, it's good to know the bombs are still there. Just unlimited bombs, guys. Solve the table. I thought you were supposed to start with five jokers. I don't... Okay, so I got this game from GOG, so I have no idea what you're normally supposed to start with, but I haven't... It's like, it, every frame, trust me, I've checked, there's no jokers. So, if I'm supposed to start with them, I'm kind of bummed, because, uh, I did not get any. Alright. We're supposed to deal with this stupid kid, and I'm so annoyed with it. I'm just over him. I'm like, I just want to, it's some sort of puzzle. There's several points where he sticks out the ball that you could grab it, but, um, it doesn't do anything. It's like if I, I'm waiting for him to come down here. If I'm standing here waiting, oops, I don't know why he did that. I don't know why either of them did that. <laughs> D6, Bob stole all the jokers. Alright, so... See, he's right there, but he doesn't, so like, I can't, and the problem is, if I have anything in my hand, I can't go in the house, I can only use it on the house. Yippee. Let me try something here, let me get him up here. I don't, irritates me, this guy keeps jumping saying yippee, I'm like, I haven't figured this puzzle out, stop, stop yippeeing. Dia 6, they were laughing at him. He's like, I can't get the mice outside, but I'll get the jokers. Yeah, it won't let us... Yeah, but it won't let us use anything on the kid. So what are we supposed to do? Russell Bassel. Bob will eliminate all who laugh. Mmm. I'm super annoyed about this. So there's the basketball player... That's a great way. Okay, so that got us nowhere. 
Let's try the slightly more tactical approach. Hey, Forty! Lovely weather for a game! Oh. Also not helpful, because... DS6, as long as his paws stay dry, he is invincible. There you go. Alright, so... That would look like it'd be super helpful, except for one thing with it. With, and the problem with that is that I can't... I can't carry anything. Yeah, stop doing that, because I don't know. If I had my net, I thought I thought they would let us keep the net, and then I was like, oh good, I can... Um, but the net just dissolved into part of the melody, I guess. Because then I thought I could take the ball from him with the net. But I should have known better. Do we have to force the kid to come out here and he has to drop the ball? That's the only thing I could think, but I don't know... So if we do this, yeah, so I don't think we can really force the kid to do anything. Like, I don't think it works like that. So what happens if we just go in every house he goes into? Come on, Fingus, go with the program. We just like, okay. Well, I'm sorry. I'm just gonna. All right, let me put him up here. Put Winkle up here. <laughs> Vinkle, Vinkle, little star, how I wonder how smart you are. It looks like he should be able to grab it, but of course he can't. Just pull him out of the window, Finkus. Come on, you're wearing that muscle shirt, showing off all that lack of chest hair. Gotta be a strong dude. Alright, I am not getting this. I don't have any jokers here. I haven't had any jokers anywhere. Mm. DS or Russ, have you guys looked at this? Have you guys looked at, the, at any hints or anything yet? Like, what am I- am I missing an item? And Do I need to get something? Totally closed off from over here. I'm aggravated they wouldn't let me take the net, because that would be perfect for the situation. Let me see... Can I, like, walk off the edge here and do something? There's, like, a rope there. Why are you saying yippee? It doesn't make any sense for you to say yippee like this. Okay, I could sit here. I can't even do anything on those. House, 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 house. Alright, let's try this. We're going to go chase him through here. The saw the table. I think I can hint. Oh. Well, since the game didn't give me any jokers, can you be my joker and give me a, a hint? The saw the table. Alright. I will be very bummed if I was supposed to start off with five. I just thought I didn't start off with any in the beginning. Saw the table. How big of a hint do you need? I'm just not sure what I'm supposed to do here. I don't know if I'm supposed to use an item or if I'm supposed to, like, figure out a pattern. But I'm not seeing a pattern. I mean, I'm, I can make him come over to, like, this house here, but I can't get the ball from him. I can't figure out what I'm supposed to interact with this kid about. Almost the point is it like the abominable snowman situation? We just exhaust him and then he eventually drops the ball. I don't know. So if that makes any sense, I, I'm missing a key. I'm missing a key component of what the thinking is here. I'm really confused as to why Fingus is jumping up and down saying yippee because he shouldn't be. Yippee. Stop saying yippee. Obviously, I don't have it. I guess what I need to know, you might already be typing, so this is a little late, but am I wasting my time with this kid? Saw the table. Don't use an item. Use both characters to trap and use the door. 
using doors. D6. Jen is really good with tiny hints, but I think the puzzle, this puzzle is super tricky. Yes. Okay, so... So if we... Okay, so when I go in here... Let me just... Let me just play this out again, even though I've seen this a billion times. Um, uh, let me go in. Here we go. If he goes in there, and he comes out there. Oh. But how do I... I have to go in right away. Okay, so if he goes in here, then Winkle's gonna go into this house. Go in, Winkle. See, here's my issue. Like, I can't figure out how to trap him, I guess, is the issue. Because when I... When we follow him... Okay, so we go in here. Winkle goes here. Because that's where he pops out at. Oh. Yeah, that's what I don't get. Like, I've trapped him before. Like, I've been waiting for him when he's come out. But it doesn't do anything. Like, I think when Fingus goes in here... Oh, no. Oh. No, wrong way. I mean, Winkle goes in here. He comes out here. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, let me see. So, where does... How does... Fingus get there? Can Fingus get there? Oh! Okay, okay, I think I got this. I think I... I let me see if this works. So, if Winkle goes in here... And Fingus goes in here... Oh no, Fingus, you went too fast! My timing was off. Okay. Let's try this again. My timing was off. Alright, try again. Man, timing is so important in this game. And there's a reason I don't play first person shooters. I am terrible. Okay, go in. Oh, see, I came out, but I didn't trap him. See, that's the part I don't understand. That's the part I'm really mad about, to be honest. Because if I'm coming out the door at the same time he is... I should totally be able to, like, shut the door behind him and say, give us that ball. So, if, okay, so, if, let me just see where, how. So, Fingus goes in this way. Is that that way? So, if he goes in here. Hmm. Okay. Okay, Winkle, go in this way. Go in this way, Winkle. Winkle, why are you getting mad? Let's see what he does. Saw the two. I'm pretty sure that's what you're supposed to do. Yeah, I'm not mad at you. I'm just mad at the... I'm trying to figure out... So if he goes in there... Okay, he comes out there. So how do I get there? So let me see. Let me see if I can do this the other way around. D6. I think she's super close too. Alright, so if you do that, you go there. You go in here. You still come out there. Go in here. Oh, this. There's something about this that really messes with my brain. Okay. So, how does Winkle get out here? Winkle can't, when Winkle goes in here, where does this take him? That's what I'm trying to figure out, is... Yuppie. Okay. Oh. Okay, don't be mad. Alright, let's try it this way. Okay, why are you so happy about this? Okay, Fingus goes in. Okay, you go in there. Fingus! Ugh. Well, you know what? 
Oh, I'm so aggravated with this right now. Because I know I should be able to figure it out, not because I'm mad at anybody. I should be able to figure this out. And, like, my brain is right there. I'm so close, and I'm just angry that it won't kick in the other two cents. I do kind of love this guy. It goes like this. Okay, so... We put... When we send Fingus in here, then it sends the kids out here. Alright, let's just do this. Oh. Yeah, but we don't go the same places. Now let's try putting fingers. Because this is the same thing. Like, this is a this is an ending loop. Oh. Alright, so if we do... I don't know if we can chase them or not, but we can make them do different things. So if I send Winkle in there, comes in here. Yeah, and then he. Okay, so when Winkle goes in here, he comes right out here. When, I mean, when Fingus goes in here, he comes right here. Winkle, where does he come out when he does that? He doesn't come out there. He comes out here. Uh, yeah, I wish I understood it too, Fingus. To be honest. Dang it. Oh, I'm going to be so mad when this, I either, someone just flat out tells me or I figure it out. I know, like, I'm supposed to trap him, but I can't figure out. I don't, yeah, because he's, yeah, but that's not helpful. Alright, so the kid, so we're going to send Fingus in here, right? Kid's gonna pop out here. I'm gonna send the kid in here. Doesn't do anything. So that to me says this is the wrong move. We send Fingus in here. No. And we need to send we need to send the kid the other way. Not you. I wanted to get Fingus down here. Okay, so let's set it up here. So Winkle goes in here. Winkle. Winkle, come on. For the love of Pete, buddy. Alright, so then what happens? We send. We'll just keep doing every other one and see what happens. Okay, so go down there. Okay, saw the table says, I'm pretty sure you've already done the correct moves, just with the timing slightly off. You just want to surprise him from behind when he's in his new location. Oh, I think I did do that once. Oh, like, I, I popped out, but it was too late. So, Winkle goes in here. Okay. I need to get, I don't have like a firm grasp on where they're popping out either, which is some of the problem. Okay, so he's happy he's going in there. I don't know why. Okay, because he pops out there. Okay, okay. So if we get him up here... Oh, guys. Okay, I think I got this. It'll take me a second to figure it out, but I think I do have it. Alright, I'm going to go over here. Not you, Winkle. Fingus, go over here. Okay, now Winkle's gonna go here. Fingus is gonna go in here. Fingus! Oh my gosh, Fingus, I'm gonna murder you. Because he goes down here, so look, he goes down here and winks at me. Like, hey, I got this, right? Like, I'm gonna pop out behind him. What happens when he goes in here? I just want to see if they come out the same spot. I just need to see what's going on here. Yeah, so he does that, but he pops out there. He does. The kid doesn't come out. He comes out of here. He comes out of here. Okay. When I go in. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. 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 
So when he goes in here, yeah, he pops out there, so that's not oh. helpful. When he goes in here, when Winkle goes in here, where does he go? Winkle, can you cooperate? Oh my gosh. No, that's not helpful. So I need, he comes out of here. When Winkle goes in here, he pops out here. But I can't. All right, so if we do this, what happens? Winkle! Winkle doesn't respond fast enough for me. Alright, let's try this again. Let me get Fingus down here. I'm just missing, like... Ugh. Alright. I'm gonna go in there after him, right? I messed up the timing. I messed up the timing. That's why. Sorry, Fingus. Winkle, could you please, like, actually do what I want you to do? Good, good gravy. Alright, so which is the one that sends him out here? There's gotta be one that sends him out here. Otherwise, it doesn't make any sense. No. Well, just chill out, dude. I'm trying to figure out where you're all going. Still not helpful. Okay, so let me put him down here. Alright, here we go. Winkle goes in here, right? Let's put. Okay, so we. Okay! So we both came out. But he came out here. gosh guys this is like the worst sorry now you go in there and you go in there let's see what happens go in there go in there come on you're already supposed to go in there oh yeah I know <sighs> all right let me let me use my notes I have in game so okay one, two, how can I make this make sense to my brain? One, two, three, four, five. All right, so when Fingus goes into house one, he comes out of house five. All right. I need to write a new note. Why won't you let me write new notes? There we go, okay. So when Fingus goes into house one, he comes out house five. So F goes into one, one to five. Okay. This is a weird thing to make notes on. All right. So when Fingus goes into house two, not you, Winkle. I'm not mapping you yet. Stop it. When Fingus goes into house two, It's like a delay, and then he comes out at house one. So Fingo goes into house two, delay, and then one. Okay. So when Fingo when when Fingus goes into house three. Then he comes out house one. Oh, I 
is this even doing this? This is even helpful, I don't feel like. Ugh. So if he does that. Oh, we got him! Oh my gosh, we got him! That was an accident. I. Ah, okay, we're saving it. <laughs> I'm never doing that puzzle again. Never, ever, ever doing that puzzle again. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, never again. Never again. Never again. <laughs> That was a chance. That was like a, a monkey's Shakespeare situation, but I'll take it. I don't care. Oh gosh! All right. So now we're supposed to do the basketball. Let's give it to ball. Let's give it to the basketball player. Okay, it didn't do anything. Let's use the basketball in the basket. DS6, with enough time and stubbornness, Jen can do anything. DJ, haha, <laughs> gosh. DS6, I was thinking monkeys too. <gasps> oh no. Okay, I'm not, I'm gonna load it up. I'm not dealing with that mess again. Never again. <laughs> I confirm, I'm going back. DJ, can you do it again? I wasn't watching. No! No, no, I can never do it again. <laughs> Saw the table. Yay! Alright, so um, if Fingus does it, then it's not a good idea. Let's see what happens if Winkle uses the basketball on the player. Okay. Still don't get how that's helpful. Alright, use the ball in the basket. Whoops. Nope. Alright, again, since I said I'm never dealing- I mean, I might have to deal- I might have to catch him again for part of the puzzle, but for right now I'm under- I'm under the impression that no, I never do. I'm never dealing with that brat again. Meany, meany, McMeanderson. Alright, so, um... Oh, I already figured this out earlier. Come down here, Fingus. Remember how Winkle uh, jumped to the basketball? That's what I just need to do. And then uh, it'll hit up here. Okay. I saw the table. Oh, wow. I didn't know you could lose the ball like that. <laughs> I'm not doing that ever again. Okay, let me just make sure I can do this basket thing. There we go. Okay, fingers. Yeah. <laughs> Yes. Yes. Okay. Shift. Okay, I'm saving it right here because I don't want to have to deal with the mirror thing again either. I'm going to go mirror. Wow, the mirror lives in a little tree house. It's kind of interesting. I confirm. Okay, so let's have Winkle talk to the mirror first. Bye, Lilia! Go and see Tom, our master. Okay, so we're just supposed to go see. Let's Fingus ask him. Thanks for stopping by, Lilia. Alright guys, hang on. I have some tea sitting behind me that I can't reach with my headphones in, so just one second. You're gonna hear me roll back and get it. Oh, dear. Oh. I'm back. Okay, two short knocks on the door. I'm with ya. 
Well, hopefully. One of them will know how to do this correctly. Oh my gosh, if we never see this treehouse again, guys, I'll be so happy. I'll be so happy. Clockmakers. You supposed to talk to him? I can't see him, because we're in the way. Okay, how do we do that? The saw the table. Oh, you're playing with the terrible voices. Yes, I am. Saw the table. I'll use the non CD version to, to, just to prevent that. Yeah. Russell says we need to treat, teach Bob how to deliver tea. We do. Okay, go ahead. Okay, that's not. Okay, here we go. All right. Oh, we could have just given the melody, I guess. Wait, are we supposed to get this before we talk to him? Okay, here, give him the melody. On Tom, aren't we supposed to? Oh, do I have the wrong guy? Is that the problem? Her fingers. Okay. We have it. Oh, you're gonna be a giant butt about this. Okay, let's let's talk to you again. Can't you just be nice to us? My goodness. Okay, so we have to get to the. We have to get up there. Is there anything the mayor has to say that's left? Like, hey, how do we get up there? Oh, never mind. All right, so let's send. I know how to send him up to do the clock thing, but I don't know how to. So here's the deal. One of these houses sends Winkle up to the clock, right? Okay. Here's the problem. I don't think I can hold on to the melody while I'm going. Yeah, using it on the house. Oh, it works. Never mind. Well, well, goodness then. Knock on the door. There we go. Talk to him. Yay! Oh my gosh, guys. If we never, ever, ever see this again, I'll be so happy. Let me save it. Get it out of... There we go. Put it in the inventory. Oh my gosh. No more. Quoth the Raven, nevermore. Nevermore. Alright, guys. We're going over. We're going to go back. We're going to go to the trench. We're done. We're done. He said, throw the hourglass of time into the trench. So we're going to do that. Here we go. Oh, he gets to stand right up there and do that. Oh, yay! Okay, we better walk over here pretty quick. Come on, Winkle. And we're gonna get in the opening, guys. Come on, Fingus. Get in there. Yes! Oh my gosh, guys, I'm so happy.
Okay, so we need progress. All right. Key of right hand. What did he say? We need the key of the fish. Okay, delete this. Good. Okay, we need the. He said the key of the fish, so that it makes sense. Key of the fish. And an imprint and a piece of metal. All right. That sounds right. So we've got. Well, we've got. Oh, mayonnaise! How helpful. DS6 says, progress! Oh, soup. Oh, there it is. There's the chest. I have to find a way to make it. Mayonnaise doesn't sound like... Okay. Let me just save it quick here to be like... Chest of fish. Oh, gosh. Russell Passel says, I think it's funny you had a flying carpet that you couldn't fly over the trends. Yeah. Really. Fish. Well, that explains the drugged out band if this is about fish. All right. Let's see if I can just pick it up. Of course, they're going to kill me. That guy has a name? Amidal. Sounds like a rustic. Okay. Gremlin. Stop. Okay, there's all kinds of different weird names. We use in the cupboard, maybe? Oh, I recognize that. Okay, let's open it up. We need an imprint. Okay, so what what did we do? Okay, we we're supposed to use the mayonnaise on there maybe to grease it up. But since I didn't try and open it before. So we've got Amidol. What have we got in our, our bag? Kind elixir. That They took everything else. Alright, Winkle. What happens if Winkle touches him? Oh, that's what happens. What happens if Winkle does this? I'm just gonna let Winkle do all this stuff and just... <laughs> Alright. What happens if he tests... Oh, gosh. He threw a knife at him. I say so he's got gum. Okay, so I did discover who has So let's switch over to Fingus. He's a little easier to like do this kind of stuff. Well guess what? You don't really have pick up one Yeah, it won't even let us pick up Oh, let me see if we can go someplace else. Oh, we can go over we can do other things. All right, so we have the forge and the well. So the well, let's see what's over there. Ooh, this is interesting. There's a hatchet. There's a crazy thing. There's Schwarzy. Hi, Schwarzy. Doesn't he look like he'll be our forever friend? Our bosom buddy? Let's try a different way. Let's get let's get Winkle up there. Winkle does a good job with this kind of stuff. <laughs> that looks painful. Try the hoist. Yeah, he's not that great. Okay. There's a hatchet. Try and get that. I'm sure that'll go fine. I mean, there's just a giant gaping mouth over it, but don't worry about it. Don't worry about a thing. Every little thing's gonna be alright. Yippee! 
Okay. Oh, he can cut things on it. Too bad I got nothing to cut. Okay, what happens when he does that? Can I press this button? Oh, there's a switch. So, when he does this... Come on, Fingus. Okay, so we hit the switch, but nothing happened. Okay. We're not, we don't know enough to do what to do over here. Just so you guys know, our new podcast I'm putting up after I'm done with tonight. Interesting. So what happens if Winkle goes in there? So once I'm done with the stream, I'm putting that up. Which I'm excited about. And I'm excited that uh, we'll be going to PAX East in April. <gasps> oh, there's a door. Okay, there's a door, dudes. There's a door in the Trojan uh, weird fish guy. No. Uh, yeah, you should. Is the animatronic? That's pretty cool. Okay, do we have to... Is that what the button's for? Okay. Okay, let's get him to do this again. Okay, let's get you to do this again. Okay, there we go. Yeah! Alright, let's see what's in here. Yeah! Thumbs up from the goblins. It's always good. Okay, he didn't get anything. What happens when uh, Winkle goes in? Hmm... down you fake ninja turtle I kind of love that lie down you fake ninja turtle mm. all right so we got that half figured out but I think we need to go to the other place first the uh, forge there's a stool Bellows, bad dudes. Could you let us pass, please? Boy, these guys are just mean. Okay, let's try this guy on him. Come here, Fingus. No, Fingus, you're supposed to talk to him. Oh, well, you talk to him. Come here, Winkle, you talk to him first. No. Alright, well, you try and talk to Otto, then, and see what happens. Not you! Winkle needs to talk to Otto. I've already seen you talk to Otto. It's not pretty sight. Okay, stop it. Come here. Back up, Fingus. Let Winkle talk to him. They kind of speak the same language. Oh, so they do different things. Like, you don't, you won't talk to him up here. Okay. Poor blacksmiths, like, these guys is who they sent. These yahoos. Yeah, that's it. We can't, yeah. Oh, there's a stool. Maybe I can pick that up. I need more inventory items. I just have a, a niceness. Alright, let's see if we can pick up the stool, because that would be nice. Stool, stool. Um, well, we're going to keep it in inventory, because I want it in my inventory. Alright, so we have a stool now. Bellows. Can we take the bellows? Can we hit the bellows? 
What happens when we do something with them? No, nothing. Oh, uh, we probably need to do this. I'm guessing after we get the stuff, we need to come over here and jump on this for him. Alright, let's go. So we have a stool now. Let's go back to the guards and see what we can do. So we need to get... Let's try Winkle on Grom. Not you. I keep Fingus. 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 Not Winkle. Oh, go ahead. What happens, Winkle, when you do? Winkle. Okay, first of all, move over here, Winkle. Fingus, what happens when you do this? He's like, don't make him mad. What happens when you do, Rustic? Hmm. Let's see if I can use the stool on there. Use the stool on the cupboard. Okay, how is the remote fully helpful? It smiled at me, but it didn't. Can I use the stool on him? Yeah, that's not. See if I can use. <laughs> I would use it on those teeth. Is what I would do. I'd be like, here you go. No, it's not helpful. Looks like this should be. Some, this is a piece of metal that looks like it would be helpful, but uh, it's not letting me. All right, what happens if I switch out, guys? What happens if I take Winkle and I use this tool? Oh, he stands up on the stool. Okay, that's interesting. And also, can I climb up here? Oh, I totally can! Okay, that's cool. But it doesn't get me anywhere. Okay, what about when Fingus goes up? What does he do? either. So why can't they, they can't open it. They need the key to open it. Yeah, I got it. They need the key to open it. Um, oh good, you took back the mayonnaise. I was a little worried about that mayonnaise, frankly. I really want, like, so this guy has, like, bubble gum. The one guy has, like, a knife that he throws. He throws a knife, though. He throws a knife over here. Not him. Where's the guy? Rustic throws a knife. Oh, hang on. Let me get this down. Let me get him down here. Let's try that again. Can I grab that? Oh, it won't let me. Alright, let's try this. Do this. Oops, let me get... <sighs> Stupid inventory items. Alright, get my stool out. Let's, can I use this tool on him? No, that's not helpful. Hmm. Alright guys, well, I think... I made a tremendous amount of progress tonight. I want to push through a little bit, but I'm feeling like we might be almost done. So, any, I was just thinking about um, ah, frustration in this game. So, as we finish this game up, I don't have a specific plan for what I'm going to stream next. I have a couple of things I want to get you guys' opinion on them. I have, so I have King's Quest Four. I have. Um, a bunch of point and clicks that I've never heard of. I have like Loom. I have a bunch of things like what would you guys like to see next after this? Alright, Fingus. So he does this. 
you won't even deal with him. So when he's, I feel like we should be able to pull that out of this guy. Or use the stool on it. What happens when Winkle uses the stool? And also, that's it. That's all it does. I'm slightly taller than... Nope. Can't. What about here? I like how this guy's looking is like, I... this is awful. What's he doing now? No, that's it. Just jump down. So using this tool isn't helpful. Okay, saying yippee, but that doesn't seem like... Nope, he's like, no, 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 don't wake him up. Totally frustrated. Well, guys, I think I'm done for the night. I think I'm going to save it here. Let me get this out of there. Now that we've picked our mayonnaise back up. Um, I'm really enjoying this game, even though I'm super frustrated with it. Um, next time. Alright, so I'm seriously thinking about doing... Um, a stream on a different day. I was thinking about a couple different days. One of the days I was thinking about doing was Saturday night and doing something different than this. So not doing another stream of my point and clicks, but doing something longer term. I have uh, Pharaoh and Cleopatra. I have to figure out how to um, get that to run in windowed mode, but that's kind of like a building game. It's also, it's also a little bit of like a military strategy game as well as kind of, it's a much longer playing term game. Like you takes you a long time to play through that game because you have to reach all these specific goals. And I have played it before, but I've never finished it. I've played through several of the epochs. And then you guys could kind of vote on what you want me to do, because there's several times in that game where it asks you... Stop being irritated with me. It asks you uh, whether or not you wanted to do... It gives you like two different things. You're like, oh, you can go over here, and you can have a military objective, and you have to build up the army, and you defend and build weapons, or you have to go over here and you have to build monuments and, and kind of do the resources. It's kind of like an Egyptian version of SimCity. DS6, ooh, Saturday with different themes sounds intriguing. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. And it'd be like a much longer play because you're doing, because you're doing more of a um, simulation game, it takes a long time to play out. So it'd kind of be a longer term thing. We'd probably have uh, looser, not that we ever have tight topics, but I kind of need you guys to have topics for things to talk about because the game, some of the game is me just kind of keeping the supply flow going. Like in SimCity, you know how you get to that point where you, you're waiting for certain things to be built. So it'd be more kind of like a chill out, uh, talk about stuff stream and also some strategy, some simulation, some historical, and it's uh, historical relevance, which is too, it's, it's a Sierra game. It's from like the early two, I'm going to say 2003, 2004 maybe. So it's still retro, but just a different premise, and I'm not trying to figure, figure out puzzles, which would be nice. So that's something I'm thinking about doing. Um, I want to do more, like, I want to push the stream a little bit and see what we can do with it. Um, I'm investing, like, you know, I kind of, I'm investing a lot of time and I'm having a good time, but I'd like to see where I can go with it. And so that means streaming more, and that means being a little bit, not, I'm not disorganized, but just being a little more organized about, like, what I'm doing. So... I just want you guys to let me know what you kind of want. Um, I want to do things that are fun. I want you to do things that are fun. So DS6 votes yes for Saturday with different theme. If you guys have any other opinions, like please let me know. Um, thank you so much for, for being here and spending time with me. And definitely your encouragement gets me through, and your hints too, I won't lie, gets me through some of these puzzles that are super frustrating. As usual, I am enjoying goblins, and I also hate goblins at the same time because it's so frustrating, but it's fun. <laughs> And I really like, like, the illustrations to me are so cute. And I do like that these guys do different things. And you kind of have to play around with it to figure it out. I enjoy that a lot, too. So, so I will be back on, what is today? 
Today is Monday. I'll be back on Thursday with goblins. And then maybe we'll talk about opening up a Saturday stream and what that would look like. Um, I will be putting up, before I go to bed, I'll be putting up our new podcast. So if you haven't subscribed to that, you can find it on iTunes or Android or go to SoundCloud. Or I even put it on YouTube, although I won't be putting it on YouTube tonight. I'll do that tomorrow because it just takes a while. Um, and it's basically me and Russell Passel reviewing a book, a movie, and a game. And so I review some of the games I stream. I re re uh, review board games. Russ does phone apps a lot, which is really fun. So if you want to check that out, check that out. Uh, please follow me on Twitter for regular updates. And also just to like interact with me because it is my business Twitter, uh, but I don't have a personal Twitter, so I kind of use it like that too. And uh, it's definitely more fun when I'm not just dealing with marketing robots all the time. <laughs> So thank you guys so much, and I will see you on Thursday night. Bye.